Stevie J's penthouse apartment might have been nice at one point in time, classic even, but now it's filled with neon tubing, tube lighting, broken down furniture, and piles of rubbish, and crates containing who knows what. Still, compared to the rest of what you've seen, it's positively palatable. The only thing marrying the penthouse's pseudo-luxury is a woman's cry of pain in the distance, followed by laughter, someone being tortured for another's pleasure. You step deeper into the apartment. All right, Paco. I'm going to need you to not fly off the handle and fuck things up. You did good back there, kid. But it's time for us to play it safe. Right, how much karma do I have? I have 12? Jeebus. All right, I'm going to... I think what I'm going to focus on with this guy is we're just going to start with... Um, first of all, my charisma is dick, so we're not going to be persuading anyone. But we are going to start with close combat melee weapons, rifle, and ranged combat. Maybe some dodge, just just for good measure. So, let's see. Um, let's start. Let's increase range combat by one. How about this. Ooh, an additional weapon slot. Um, that really doesn't help me, so I'm not going to rush off to do that. But I will try to get some more rifle damage here full auto, I could totally just open up on some cats. What about, what about this? Um, close combat, I like that. Uh, pummel strike, only AP damage. Does that seem like something we people want to do very often? I'm pretty much all about killing people. An AP, well I guess you could keep someone from taking turns. That's kind of cool. Let's do that. Um, then let's look at I don't know, let's, let's, I don't... Focus, maximum for humans. I don't really know about this other stuff. Let's see, biotech. Decking, spell casting, chi casting, charisma. If I get new etiquette... Oh, I could have Shadowrunner etiquette. Let's do that. I think that's good. All right, confirm. We are leveled up. Good to go. Oh, damn it, Paco. Oh, this is like combat zone. All right, well, go forward. There they are. Who the hell are you? Oh, Jeebus. Paco. Put your insides back in. Oh, my God. All right. My bad, guys. That dude's some a demon or something. A raspy, manic voice booms over the penthouse PA system. Really think you could come in here and shoot up my place? Do you know who you am? I know who you are. You're the guy I'm gonna kill. Aw, oh, yeah. Master of all forms of communication. Alright, Paco, you go first. See if you can smack this guy. Well, that wasn't too bad. Um, I'm gonna move up here. I'll switch out for my rifle, and I'm going to take my aim shot, if that's cool. So then at least I'll hit him. Get him! Yeah! Alright, guys. Looks like Paco, you're going to get your shit killed. Oh, what is that guy doing? Alright. Well, there's Stevie J. Let's, uh... Annihilate that guy. I have this, like, huge pet peeve with things that let the villain get away, so I'm gonna make sure that doesn't happen. Oh, he healed himself. That's cute. Ow. Paco, your butt. Make sure it's still attached. This guy's just doing whatever. Oh, he increased what he did. Still missed. I have yet to see anything that exciting come out of magic so far, but I know that it's going to be really, like, really brutal when I do get hit. Alright, Paco, kill him. Kill him. There we go. But no, I can't. With a bloody gurgle, Stevie J is no more. Yeah, the hell he is. Get the hell dead. I really don't like you, Stevie J. You're a drug dealer and a butt. Okay, so... Yeah. Paco, dude, Paco's probably dead. No, he's good. Alright. 
Paco, why don't you kill up the magic user? Alright, and I'm gonna just move forward one. I'm gonna try to shoot up that man. Might as well. Oh, I could aim and I could hit the magic user a little bit. Yeah, that's not bad. Alright, you're gonna shotgun me. Oh, why? Well, I guess not. That's nice. All right. Where's my machete? Just keep after him. Paco and your little baseball bat. That is a very bad weapon. Oh, they're retreating. All right, well... Only takes one, so I'll just chase him and hit him with the machete some more. Yeah, no more for you. All right, then let's switch to my gun and then let's move up. All right, Paco, you go kill that spellcaster. I know he's over there. Yeah, there. There we go, laying the smack down. All right, there are still more bad guys here somewhere. All right, well, we got Stevie J's passcodes. That's worth something. Paco, you are about to die, so like, can I use like an item? Yeah, here. Hit up a med kit, I think. There. Fun, fun. Alright, let's move. Let's just charge forward. I'm an orc, damn it. Might as well. Um, locked door? Oh! Hey, I think that's. Yeah, there. You dicks! Ow! The room beyond bars is a stinking jumble of burned flesh and dog flop. An enormous hellhound, its fur streaked with whip marks, growls low. The eyes of a second hound burn menacingly in the corner. Shove the zebra meat through the bars. Hellhounds devour the zebra meat in a few massive bites, and they let out a contented growl. Open the door. Are we done? No more fighting? Oh, we're still fighting. All right, well, let's move. Oh, there's guys in there beating on her. All right. Paco, keep, just keep calm. Keep calm, buddy. We're going to open the door. Here we go. Oh, dang. Keep Coyote alive? Okay. Yeah! Damn, she does as much damage as Paco does with a baseball bat with her fists. Also, this is a good time for me to pull out my machete. There we go. Alright. Hey, Coyote, what's up? Other than you just being tortured, I guess I should probably not ask. Damn. About time you got here, Paco. Who's your friend? Right now, I'm the guy who's saving your ass. And I see that, and I appreciate it. Coyote, we need to get you back to the Union. Miss Kubota has a med lab in the basement. No, she speaks through gritted teeth. I need to finish the other thing I came here for. I need something for Mr. Delilah first. A stash of gems. Delilah, I thought you said you'd never do another deal with that man. Look, Paco, I needed an excuse to come back here and settle some debts. Figured... Figured I might as well get paid for it. Her voice is strong still, but her body is beginning to shake. Coyote, you need medical attention. Uh, Paco, get her back to the Union. I'll get the gems. Come on. Get your skin fade out of here. Alright, I'm going to go find the, I'm gonna find the gems, I think. Alright, so I've got his passcodes. So I'm going to assume... I can get in, like, to this locked door, perhaps? Yes, indeed. Many things. Nuyen, I can take $25, no problem. Junk. There you sit. Advanced med kit. I really... Yeah, what's... Oh shit, that is a hellhound. 
God damn. All right. Uh, Serrano. What? Serrano. Serrano. Die. I would have let. I would have let. Like I would have taken care of you, man, just like your friends. But you, you attacked me. I'm really sorry. Oh man. All right, come on. Sorry, dude. All right, let's get the thing. Let's get, get out of here. Velvet bag filled with precious gems. All right, um, let's get on out of here then. All right, and with that short ass kicking, we're heading back to the Seamstress's Union. So that's where we're gonna stop for now. Yeah, a little bit short of an episode, but meh. Um. Catch us next time. We'll put Coyote back together, hopefully tell Paco he's a dumbass, and get paid.